Welcome to our podcast, where we cover unique and interesting stories for you. In this episode, we will discuss NASA's ultraviolet photos of Mars shifting seasons. Do you know what Mars looks like when it changes the seasons? In the images captured by NASA's Mars atmosphere and volatile evolution spacecraft, Earth's neighbor can be seen changing its attributes as the seasons change on the red planet. These photographs were taken during the summer season of the Southern Hemisphere, when Mars was closest to the Sun. In the images captured by NASA's Mars Atmosphere and Volatile Evolution spacecraft, Earth's neighbor can be seen changing its attributes as the seasons change on the red planet. These photographs were taken during the summer season of the Southern Hemisphere, when Mars was closest to the Sun. Subsequently, in January 2023, after Mars' northern hemisphere had reached the farthest point in its orbit from the Sun, Maven photographed the planet once again. The purple regions in the images represent the presence of ozone in Mars's atmosphere, while the white and blue areas indicate the occurrence of clouds or haze in the planet's sky. The surface of Mars appears tan or green in these new images. NASA officials stated that observing the planet in ultraviolet wavelengths allows scientists to gain valuable insights into the Martian atmosphere and observe surface features in extraordinary ways. Similar to Earth, Mars also rotates on a tilted axis, resulting in the experience of four distinct seasons. However, due to the longer Martian year, the seasons on Mars are approximately twice as long as those on Earth. When Mars's southern hemisphere is tilted toward the Sun, the planet orbits closest to it, leading to significantly hotter temperatures during the southern summer compared to the northern summer. This temperature increase causes heightened turbulence, stronger winds, and larger dust storms in the southern hemisphere. The warmer temperatures of summer prompt the shrinkage of the southern polar ice caps, subsequently releasing carbon dioxide and leading to a thicker atmosphere. MAVEN, launched in November 2013 with the purpose of studying the planet's atmospheric gases, has also detected an increase in hydrogen loss from Mars during this time of the year. This phenomenon is likely a result of dust storms propelling water vapor to high altitudes. By studying these systems, scientists can gain a better understanding of the evolutionary history of the Red Planet. NASA officials have said that comprehending atmospheric loss provides valuable insights into Mars' past atmosphere and climate, the existence of liquid water, and the potential for planetary habitability. NASA's MAVEN mission will soon mark its 10-year anniversary since entering Mars's orbit in September 2014. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to subscribe and share your thoughts in the comments. Stay connected for more exciting discussions and updates in our next podcast.